Hello everyone, uh, my name is Rilla Edwards and I am the blogger behind Perfect Stitch. Um, today I want to make a, my ponytail earband headband. Um, so what you need is a 5mm hook, a ponytail holder, uh, scissors, a tapestry needle uh, to weave your ends, um, two stitch markers, and I'm using Vanna's Choice Lime Brand Yarn in Silver Blue. Um, so first, uh, put a slip knot on your hook, um, and then join your yarn um, to your ponytail holder with the chain one. Uh, so you're going to want to make 24 uh, single crochet stitches around this. And if you count as you go, that's fine because I do too. <laughs> Um, this ponytail uh, ear warmer is actually really easy to make. Um, and there's, you know, so many different um, things you can do with it. Uh, I know I've done the owl, uh, fox, uh, mommy, mommy and me, um, a rain, a Rudolph, uh, the red-nosed reindeer. Um, let me count my stitches here. Um, so you make 24 um, and then slip stitch into your first stitch and chain one. Uh, now you're going to want to do two rows of half double crochet stitches. Um, if you're not familiar with that, uh, you just yarn over, uh, insert into the stitch, yarn over, pull through, yarn over, and pull all three. And that creates a half double. Um, so you want to make one in each stitch around. Um, so that'll be 24. And you're going to have two rows uh, of this. I've also done this in the um, Carolina Panthers, um, since I do live here in North Carolina. Um, so I wanted to make one for the Carolina Panthers fans. Um, Okay, and there's 24 uh, slip stitch join, chain one, um, complete one more row of 24 stitches. There's 15, 16, 17. I like to count, I'm sorry. Now, there's 24. Now, I think um, here's the part that may get confusing for some. Um, what you want to do. Uh, you want to make, um, you want to do just eight stitches on this next row. So the fourth row only has eight. Seven, eight. Eight stitches. Now from here, what you're going to do, you're going to, you have those eight stitches and you're going to count over um, one, two, three, four, five. And you're going to place a stitch marker. And then from the fifth stitch here, you'll, you'll count that stitch. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Um, and you'll place the second stitch marker. This way, um, when, when you're looking at this, uh, you've got the eight stitches. And then you have um, a four skip stitches on this side and four skip stitches on this side. Um, this way, as you work around, uh, keep increasing doing your rows, um, the, the end is going to come around and join in this, between these two stitch markers. Um, so ultimately you have, um, you know, so you just have that four stitch gap. Now, 
uh, from here uh, for this next row, uh, you will do an increase. So you will add uh, two HD stitches in the first stitch, and then one, and then one, one in the next um, six stitches. And then two in the last. Um, so that way you go from eight um, to 10 stitches. Uh, and then you'll chain one, and then now and again you'll do uh, two stitches in the first stitch, and then one stitch in the next uh, eight. And then two stitches in the last. Um, now, now, and then chain one. Okay, so you have your 12. Now you're going to just keep working the um, 12 stitches back and forth, um, you know, to like 40, uh, I think uh, 45, 44, 45 rows. Uh, just uh, put it on your head and see. Uh, you may not need as many rows as I did, um, you know, for, for mine. Um, my head is a 21-inch circumference. Um, so I made, um, you know, uh, 40, 44 rows, I think it was. Um, but you can do a row or two short if you want. Um, once you complete that many rows, um, then you will do, um, you know, you want to decrease back down to 10 stitches, decrease down to 8 stitches. And once you get back to 8 stitches, uh, you will join... Uh, slip stitch or whip stitch, whichever you prefer, um, the last eight stitches of the row to uh, this side of the headband. And that's going to make your uh, ponytail headband. Um, I, I'm going to try to do a, a, a longer tutorial um, once I can find my tripod um, to do with my camera since my cell phone doesn't have as much memory on it um, to allow me to sit here and, and make the whole um, ear warmer um, without running out of memory um, so it will stop um, but I did want to give you an idea of how you do uh, make this uh, so from here just continue um, going back and forth on your rows uh, when you get to you know mine was to row 44 uh, then you will um, HDC two stitches together uh, HDC uh, in the next eight stitches, HDC two together, and that brings you back down to 10. And then HDC two together, uh, HDC in six stitches, HDC two together will bring you back to eight uh, stitches. And then you're ready to attach that eight to the where the two stitch markers um, in the, that space. Um, so anyway, I hope this helps and clarifies uh, how you make this. Uh, it's actually really simple uh, to make. Um, so I wish you luck. If you have any questions, please feel free to message me or, um, you know, I'm on, um, you can comment on my blog. Uh, that's at rilla2u.blogspot.com.